Yo, what's up guys, it's Veda, and I thought I'd do another Tekken video for you guys today. This is, of course, going to be a player match uh, video. So, I thought I'd just take Jin and a uh, quick match and just play around with him, just trying to get a, a feel for him again, and obviously play against like characters. I don't actually know cool. how to play against. Like right there, Negan Power Crush. I could have. What's it called? Uh, can Can that? But I didn't. Because you see Negan players so seldomly on uh, Tekken that it's it's uh, just become like second nature not to like punish accordingly, and it's really annoying me. But anyway, try to parry that because I know that can be parried. Like the bat. He's back, can be parried. And this guy loved to do that, that free hit string. But yeah, he, he does, that's another thing as well about Negan as well, he does so much damage as well from just very little moves. That's one thing I've actually noticed about uh, Negan is like the, the overall damage that he can do. Even Jin can do a lot of damage, but you need to actually have like good execution as well to like pull it off. But with Negan, you don't really need that. So just try to like obviously like get in, do some poking, and then obviously KBD him. Like basically, see there, I knew that was the opportune time to actually parry it, but I didn't get it. But tries to go for the, I think that's the unblockable grab from Intimidation Stance, but I knew he was going to try and do that, so that's obviously why I opted for the Rage Art there. See, he, li he likes to do that string, and for some reason the parry whiffed. But I get it this time, and then obviously fought up with a pretty damaging combo. Get him there with an electric, boom. Easy $100 combo. Round four. Oh, sorry, they made it easier to actually do that combo. See, he's not actually. He's learning not to do that string, but. He does still do it anyway, which is quite funny. Get him again with that combo. I could have two four them at that point. You win. But I didn't. But anyway, GG's. And then I find them again on Noctis' stage. I can't even remember what the stage is called. Hammerhead something. Hammerhead Sanctuary. I don't know. But he still makes the same mistake, he always goes for that, that free hit string which obviously can be parried. But he's, he's, he's learning not to but sometimes he will do it. I need to remember as well that has a uh, the uppercut there, uh, not the uppercut, the launch, the, the launcher he has uh, can be punished by what's it called two four as well. See, he's playing a, he's still playing a lot of aggressive, but he's been a bit more careful as well when he like does that stuff. But yeah, got him there with it. And this is going to be pretty big damage if it connects to the wall. KO. Get him there with a uh, forward four, three. as you do with Jin. A lot of people complain that Jin got nerfed a lot. I'm one of those people that actually want him to get nerfed because, yeah, like there, you see there, he did that strength. 
And I thought that would be at the wall, that's why I did that. <laughs> I get a miss input, but yeah. I'm one of those people that actually wanted Jin to get nerfed, because that's all I just saw in ranked, and I didn't break that full. That's all I saw in ranked when I was uh, played like all the characters was Jin's just doing forward four, just so they can get the counter hit, and then obviously what's it called, uh, neutral four. And then obviously it would be on counter hit and it was just, oh, it was just retarded. That's basically all you ran into. The only thing about Jin that really didn't really need uh, fixed, well nerfed, should I say, was his uh, down back four, which could launch on counter hit. You could get like, a, a free launcher on counter hit. You took that away and it's like, it's that uh, it just basically like crushes them down, so you can't like uh, combo. You can only get like one combo from it, well, one uh, hit, which is uh, either uh, down two or down, down two or the flip kick that he does. Uh, uh, what's it called? Uh, four plus three at the same time, obviously. So we have a Brian here, and this Brian, this guy that was playing Brian was really fucking good. He actually bet me a couple of times as well. I should actually note that, he actually got a lot of wins on me as well, but I eventually figured them out. He doesn't like to take throws. And I played him again uh, last night, he was a how wrong player as well. Really, just a typical uh, Huron player with like strings and stuff, but he was really good. Really good. I just, I just find it really weird that you find these kind of players that just prefer to play quick match rather than actually getting really high up in the ranks because this guy really could actually get really high. Because he's he, Brian was really good. But I just, as soon as I like, I, I clicked on to how he played, I'm like, I, I can do this. I can beat this game. But yeah, really good brines. Uh, really solid defense as well. I'm not actually sure if he plays an arcade stick because he's, he's not really back swaying as much. For those that you don't know, uh, Brian can he can KVD, you can actually backdash with Brian, but in some instances it's like some of his uh, key moves are actually pinned to backsway, which is basically the backdash. And this guy really just shows you how uh, you can backdash with him, see? But it's really fucking tricky to do. Wall combo. Yeah, that's another thing about Jin. Jin's wall, uh, wall uh, combo enders are ridiculous and they do a lot of damage as well. Perfect. But if you do a, a crazy uh, electric combo and then you continue it like you hit them at the wall, you're gonna get about 80. 81 damage. And if you hit some if you hit someone uh, from a what's it called a shit I can't remember the word. If you hit someone from a, like a a wall break or a balcony break, you're gonna get a lot of damage as well. See, this guy really knows how to play Brian, he's just waiting for me to like, uh, gets me there with a snake egg. That's something that I wrote to him, I said, he said that he was just warming up, and I said, what, were you just warming up with snake edges? Because that's all he, all he was doing this uh, match, he was, he was only like using snake edge, which I think. I found quite funny. But yeah guys, after this video gets uploaded, I should be able to do that video that I promised a while back on that. 
uh, special Star Wars item that I actually got. It actually came yesterday and I actually unboxed it and checked to see if everything was okay with it. And yes, everything is okay with it. I'm actually looking at it right now and it's it's one hell of a piece if I do say so myself. It's I can't wait to show you guys it and review it for you. Because it is one hell of a piece. And I know you guys will actually really really like the review on it because I'm trying to actually showcase it with like the actual hot toys uh, a new hope Darth Vader Round might show one. you guys like the actual Fight. Uh, uh, overall scale of it as well. But that's for after this video gets uploaded. So we're fighting against a Gigas player and yes, that's another thing as well I hear about quick match. You get all the characters that you don't know how to play and it's it's annoying. Like this guy right here, he's won ten wins. And he's re he was really good as well, he does. See right there, the wall damage is so good with Jin. And I don't get why people don't take that throw. It's a two break. And it's not like, what's it called, uh... Round three. What do you call it? It's not like, uh... It's like you mix it up, like if they don't take that throw, you, you're, it's just easy to get a win off. But anyway guys, this is going to be the end of the video just coming up anyway. I hope you guys have enjoyed my commentary and obviously the matches themselves. Like I said, I'm going to have that video on that special Star Wars item up pretty soon. Maybe it'll be up later or tomorrow sometime but anyway guys i hope you enjoyed these matches and i plan on making more soon so as ever guys take care and thanks for watching cheers guys thanks